Okay, hello everyone. Uh, today we are going to work on Fira code on a little non-standard feature that is called arbitrary length arrows. So we figured this could be done. It's not going to be our normal ligature, but I think by using open type substitutions, it can be done uh, easily uh, for both directions. So this is what we'll try to do today. So it might be interesting because I am not sure if it will go okay or not. And we'll see, okay? So uh, this is the issue. The idea is to have uh, like errors like this of any length. Obviously we couldn't write a substitution for any length, uh, any arrow. Uh, so we have to be inventive, right? So this is what I'm going to do. Okay, so what we're going to do, I need glyphs. I need to open figure code. Okay, so right now, if we are doing something like this and we enable fixed alternates. Yeah, so this is not an error even. So this is an error, right? Um, or, or this is an error, uh, this is, just this so it ends after third dash and after that even dashes stop to be joined okay so um yeah so the first thing we need is we go to uh let me add smart filter here ligatures and three oops okay uh -huh. Okay, so this, uh, these are all our ligatures and what we need to do is we need to disable the ones that will get in our way. So the ones that will be this, uh, this, it's not always easy to, so just turn off them as export uh, so that disables them, they don't go to the font file. And yeah, as it's, we don't need them right now. We'll bring them back, hopefully. Um, <laughs> yeah, let's start with simple ones, okay? So simple ones must be this, this, okay. And there must be something like less, less hyphen, um, less, Let's uh, right. And, uh, let's, let's hyphen this one. Yeah, basically all this will have to go for now. Uh, okay, let's just filter by hyphen and <laughs> disable everything that contains hyphen, right? So hyphen bar probably have to go, hyphen greater. Yes, hyphen greater, greater definitely has to go. Uh, hyphen less, hyphen less, less. Yes. Um, yeah, we'll have to <laughs> rebuild all this, uh, but it's okay. It's okay, I think. Okay, this will be hard to do. So if it starts, well, maybe this one don't have to go. This one can go, this one can go, this one can go, this one stays, this can go, this can go, and yeah, this is, okay, I forgot which one, so this, there will be a lot of work to bring them back, but hopefully we can manage. Yeah, okay, so let's leave bars for now, yeah, okay. And this one, let's leave it as well. This one, this one, yeah. Okay, so now we've disabled those. We go to terminal, we go to Fira code directory. So what we need to do is call update glyphs, which will open glyphs file, regenerate, ligatures and save it back. So I'll have to reopen 
but now the code that produces those ligatures it actually applies them from cult it must be gone so here we should not be able to find for example less high yeah so let's let's get the bar there but that's all okay but this is fine okay uh we will probably have to manually create those okay so now uh we need a few building blocks right so the building blocks would be like uh arrow and less and hyphen and hyphen continued and okay let's let's figure it out um the first one will be okay let's go to all and let's add them here i probably don't need the filter as well let me move dog to the left so it won't appear here okay so um what do we do what do we do yeah uh, adding this okay uh so first one is we need less hyphen right i think we have that actually yeah yeah so yeah i'm, I'm just let's call them i'm just worried that this one will be overridden and we don't want that right so let me see let me see so we go here and put rem so just a name and we add new smart filter removed and swiss dot rem okay we have a few of those so this is okay um so less hyphen then hyphen continues hyphen greater okay let's see hyphen greater we have those la, 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 hyphen great hyphen hyphen greater hyphen greater yeah so this one we remove move it to rem as well okay and now we can add new new symbol so we need less hyphen it's called liga um hyphen cont it's actually not a ligature but it's for simplicity and hyphen greater okay let's make them here mark them as blue so we um this is needed basically for so it's easier to find okay 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 remove this okay so we have three of those okay so let's hyphen okay let's we don't need that we don't need that uh we need actually hyphen we are taking this and does it have to change it actually doesn't have to change so maybe i just bring it back yeah okay um less hyphen yes we just bring it back from liga i had to, i should have made it blue first okay so it's here okay so if this works okay the most interesting part is okay let's open all three so the first one is no less hyphen let's go it goes here so less hyphen is the first two if we see two characters like less and then hyphen we replace them with this with white space and this this is okay this is normal right uh the interesting part is if we see a hyphen after after this we actually need something different okay and let me just 
radical. I don't. Oh, this is strange. Oh, this is because for some reason I'm not sure why, but character reads default character reads is okay. So let's see. So the trick is uh, this ends 259 from the right. So basically, this one we decompose and we make it extend to the left, right? So basically. Uh, that's the trick. That's all the trick. So uh, instead, we replace hyphen with with this. Okay. So here uh, we have two seventeen. Decompose. Select. Minus two seventeen. Okay. Um, this is not as I would like it to be. Okay. So we need to figure out the. Right of this, right? This should be simple. We just match the height, yes. And where is it? Match the height here. I think we are good. Okay, uh, does it match on this? Yeah, here it seems to match. Perfect. Okay, great. Uh, so this is a trick, and uh, yeah, and yeah. Actually, we need to make sure that um, the space from the right is consistent. So we had two fifty nine, and we have two seventeen, and it must be the same here. Actually, one hundred sixty-seven. Oops. Um, no. Here we have 259. Okay, so that's the trick, right? Ah, no, and now we have to write code. Okay, so let's let's go into this and write some code. Um, no, I actually I'm going to write in Sublime text. Let me call it up. Yeah, so the code is going to be me just copy something so it's gonna be arrows oh, let's call it arrows okay ignore we don't need for now this uh, we don't need as well oh, this is a bad example let me uh, uh. again let's call it arrows ignore we ignore for now and now there is less space sir. so b basically the basic is basis is uh, less hype and we remove less with less spacer and hype and we remove uh, less hype and leg up right but this is only the part because after that okay, we need to space it up. After that, what we are going to do, if we see um, this or we see hyphen continued liga, one of those, and then we see hyphen, right? We replace it by hyphen continued liga. Okay, so that's our code. Um, the, the, the editor here is laggy, so that's why I'm not using it. I'm going to put it here. I'm going to put this comment in there. This I, I'm not sure what it will. Okay, so this already should work. Let's see, let's compile. Oops. Less hype and dot liga not in font. This is strange, right? Because I didn't. Yeah, because I didn't mark it as export. So. Okay, okay. Um, now it's in the font. We compile. 
we go here, for example, right? So here we just edit. Here we're going to, and this is our arbitrary length arrow. Um, yeah, we, we don't handle this case yet, but we will, right? So the difference is going to be here, we just remove this, we remove this, we add uh, height and greater, greater, okay, and we decompose and we change this so that it matches perfectly. Go here, uh, remove this, remove this, add the same component, we decompose, and we make them match. I am not sure yet, but sometimes a little bit of overlap is good here. Uh, maybe I will add it later. Not sure. Yeah. So for now, this is like uh, pixel to pixel, right? But editors sometimes insert some gaps between um, between glyphs because of pixel rounding or something. So we don't want that, right? Okay. But uh, first, let's see. Let's see our code here. So let's actually copy this. The, it's an entirety. I'm not sure if Sublime, any chance Sublime has. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. No. Install open type feature things. I think it's what I'm Yeah, that's it, I think. Let's see. No. Maybe it's called Git Vault, Sublime Go, Go, Refresh, Git Vault, Tina. I don't see it. Maybe it's, it's not the devil's script. This? I don't know. AFDQO. What's that? Adobe Font Development Kit. Yeah, yeah, maybe it's that. It's that. Okay, anyway, I am using minimal scheme, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, anyways, so uh, what we need right now is if we see this and then this, or if we see this and then this, right? So basically, uh, if we see less hyphen legal or hyphen continued and then greater we remove it by hyphen greater now actually i'm going to call it uh, greater cont for consistency okay okay let me First, rename it actually. Cont. Okay, and then we go here. We replace this. Replace. We can compile. Okay, let's see. So this seems to work. No matter how many of these we insert, at the end it's decent error, right? So we don't support these arrows, we don't support these arrows. Actually, we want to support this as well, but not for now. Okay, um, the problems. Bolt works as well. Okay, no, not the problems. Okay, the first thing we need right now is let's just test it, right? So. I'm exporting to directly to my system folder and I will need to restart Sublime. 
let's see this is your code right yeah this is your code um, okay <laughs> it seems to work and it seems to work okay but uh, yeah so this is like 13 which is a perfect pixel perfect size for fira if we set it to for example 12 so you see there are slight gaps in between and we also want to get rid of this uh, it, it got better no round don't run glyphs with one space one reference size is small i'm not sure okay let's say say well no round look, looks actually looks better than it's like almost like round okay but anyways you see there are small gaps between them so let's try and fix those right uh, there are, there are some precedents in here um horizontal yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, box horizontal i think we need one of this oops no <laughs> no th these are fine um yeah this so for here you see that it uses overflow of 10 pixels so maybe not pixels but units uh, fonts are measured in units so maybe that's what we will go so here it's 10 as well yeah because everything else is 10 so we are, i think we're going with 10. um so just over now i'm confused did i broke something no Oh yeah, because it, this moves because it's the same character. Yeah, sure, of course. Um, let me see if in bold. Oh, no, we don't have bold. But anyway, yeah. Um, yeah, ten is good. Okay, so we have overflow of ten, and here we need this. Enter this as well. Okay, so we make this and we make this. Okay. Another experiment. Another export. Let me just restart Sublime. Okay, so gaps didn't go away. Maybe we need more. Okay, let's go. Um, no, 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 no. I'm just trying to figure out the biggest possible gap that will be there. I'm not sure how to calculate that. Okay, but obviously 10 didn't work, so let's go with 20. Um, yes. doesn't look better does it um let me see if i have yeah i have it visual studio code um, i think yeah figure code uh, font 15 ligatures to whatever so for some reason it is better isn't it yeah, I think it is better. Okay, um, that's it. No, it's 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 problematic because if I make font bigger, I won't see the problem. That's that's a problem. Uh, let me open a screenshot of this. Yeah. So the problem with overlaps is that you get those annoying dots here you see okay I, I think i'm going to go with 10. you can't make it perfect unfortunately 
I wish I could make it perfect. But the way fonts are rendered on different systems, it's, it's just impossible. Okay, um, hmm. <laughs> I'm not even sure. It was pretty easy, right? So uh, we have. Okay, so now we can start adding like this, this. Let's figure out what we want, right? So I think we need this. I think we need this. Uh, we probably need this. Um, and we need this, right? So this is like arbitrary length lengths of dashes. I actually, I was thinking that maybe something like this should exist as well. Um, what that would be, it would be tables, right? I think we have some in here. Yeah, so GitHub tables like, like this. I'm not sure why there's, there's space. What? Huh. Oh, yeah, so this is strange. Is there is your space now. I, I probably won't do that. But anyway, um, I think something like like this, right? And also probably like this. So plus and this one probably should render the same. Um, this one is, yeah, the problem is this one might be in the middle of the table or at the top of the table. Okay, let me just Google GitHub mark mark down table. Uh, here table extension. Yes, I recommend actually recommend putting space between them. I, I guess it looks better. sure what this is about okay whatever yeah maybe we don't do those at least yeah at least uh, these are the ones that we need to support to to be at least as good as we was before right okay so let me let me do what? Let me just draw those ones, these ones, right? So they are going to be um, this. Okay, yeah, one thing I need to check is that cursor is still perfectly fine. Oh, did I check? Yeah, yeah, I didn't check this. Yeah, okay, so uh, we actually need first, we need this as well. But, yeah. And that is going to be tricky-ish. So the problem here is because we have ligature for this and ligature for this, and we don't want to turn them into the line, right? So we want to turn them into the line if we have at least four of them, but otherwise we don't want that. So we probably want this and this <laughs> as separate ligatures and by extension do this. So right now, if I write this, I get, yeah. So we want this. Uh, hmm. So this, this, this should all stay, actually no. I mean, these two should stay as ligatures, right? So we go back 
and we and yeah. Okay, so they are now back in the game. Uh, what about this? Right, so this probably should be its own ligature. Should it? I'm not sure. So the trick is, so we have this right, right arrow, right? We already have it. Let me go. Well, actually, the problem is that left arrow and right arrow of different lengths. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it slightly differently. So we, <laughs> we actually remove this, right? We can duplicate this. But yeah, let's just remove it. And we can take it. Okay. And it's gone. Uh, let's start our own group, which we are going to call arrows and we we going to call them this and this and this are going to oh sorry Iowa. going to this group Okay, we also need, um, yeah, I don't need this cont anywhere. Okay, um, I'm just trying to figure out how to make well definitely need this error. It's gonna be hundred is everything. Um Yeah, it's this, it's this, this one doesn't exist. Okay, so right now I'm just trying to figure out how, ultimately how we want this to be composed, right? And we have, No, I think it's it's okay for now. Okay, let's let's rename this less hyphen Oh actually we can what we can do is do this hyphen by hyphen r w and then if we see hyphen r w right and then just hyphen we replace it by 
hyphen r double and if we see hyphen r double like a greater we yeah so this is how it is it should be slightly less complicated okay let's let's see if we now let's name for this so what do we want we want this oops yeah this is strange i guess the problem is that we didn't regenerate hyphen this exclamation hyphen or greater hyphen hyphen mm -hmm. yeah i think the problem is that we need to rerun the script okay and now open code now it's it's very strange but maybe i didn't yeah yeah because i didn't change the sorry this has to be blue um it actually has we have 259 decompose Pause. Uh, okay. okay, so we need to move this uh, like this. Okay, and do the same here. Okay, so I think if we do it this way, boom, 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 boom. Okay, okay, so for some reason, this hyphen is not getting replaced, right? So this one is replaced, the hyphen is not. Let's see. For Yeah, because we need it to be like this, right? Yeah, this is what we need. Yes, 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 yes. Alt, alt. okay so oops yeah um this one they are disabling our beautiful arrows for some reason but after that they work okay so let's see if we can um Undo this and undo this. No, let's actually let's let's worry about. No, I cannot worry about later. It's about time we start to worry about those. Um, actually, what I'm thinking of. Let's find. Let's find them in here. It should be hyphen, hyphen, hyphen. Okay, so yeah, here it is. All right, so basically it says to ignore 
four hyphens, four hyphens and more, um, which is okay for us, which is okay for us, but, 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 but. We actually need something else as well. Let's find just two hyphens. Um, no, we, we didn't find found two hyphens. Yeah. Okay. So let's save. Let's close the file. Let's go to our code that uh, produces us, and you're going to find your prefixes ignore. So yeah, here we have ignores, and I think what we need is just don't apply this ligature. Um, what, what? Okay, this this are the ones that we want to to alter, right? So hyphen greater. We don't have those for now. Hyphen greater. We don't have those. Okay. Yeah. And here, what we want to do is we want less hyphen. Just ignore. Right. Um, Hyper, hyper, great. Yeah, something like this. Something along those lines. Mm -hmm. Less. Great. Okay, let's see. Let's uh, run it and see what we got. Uh, space, yeah. Okay, so we need glyphs. We need to reopen. Okay, cool. So now, okay, let's create some tests like this. Okay. So our test bed is gonna be uh, this long. Then we need this and this. Okay, so now what do we do now? Um, huh. So our our dash 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 ligature got undone, right? Actually, I'm going to, yeah, okay. So this has to be its own ligature. So we get, have to return this. Uh, to go, we go here. Yes, I, 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 I didn't actually put ramp suffix there, right? Hyphen, hyphen, greater. Okay. There must be hyphen, just hyphen, greater. Some reason there isn't maybe it's a yeah, hyphen greater. Okay, we need this to be exported actually. So this one stays, right? This one stays. What about this one? In theory. If we are not replaced by this or this, right, we have to start building our own. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay, let me do let me do it. Let me do it now. Yeah. Okay, we need one more. We need so we have hyphen uh where but it's actually hi it's actually hyphen cont and we need hyphen start. Okay, we go here we We, we put this, but uh, what I'm going to do is no, not this. I'm going to do is I'm going to figure out 259 to So I'm going to match it on the left side. Okay, so this is hype and start, right? So what we do with it is we <laughs> okay, so let me see. So what we do is if we see hyphen and then hyphen, right? Then we replace <laughs> first one by hyphen start over, right? And now We just add this one. Seems okay ish. And in here we actually want both start or cont. This is how I envision this to work. We go to count. Um, replace this. Try to compile. Yeah, hyphen error doesn't exist. I'm not referencing it. Am I? Yeah, uh, um, I know what the problem is. Probably we need to close. And I'll delete this. Probably one of the glyphs got into some collection and was mentioned in other place. So now this should compile actually. Yeah, it compiles. Cool. Um, yeah, let's let's close this and test. All right. So bring in this. Yeah, you see, uh, it works. This one doesn't work for some reason. I'm not sure why. I did return hype and greater, right? And we also need this, 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 and cool. So if we have more than four dashes, they begin to blend into a single line. If we can place, um, let me think of it. We can place, yes, yeah, this shouldn't be that. Okay, cool. Um, this one concerns me. Why doesn't it work? Let's go to the font. Let's find ligatures. Let's find hyphen greater it's no it's this one let's go here this is hyphen greater right so it exists hyphen greater huh. let's find it here It 
it doesn't exist here. It's strange. Oh, because I didn't rena rename it. Uh, sorry. Yeah, I have to rename it here. Uh, we close this. We update glyphs. We go back to glyphs. We reopen. I wish it uh, it would have a option to reload. See you. Okay, let's arrow greater. Now almost everything <laughs> works except for this one, right? So uh -huh. somehow it didn't got turned. This is actually because in hype and greater in this ligature we well, because this it goes first. Uh, so the problem, the problem, right? So this ligature goes first. And it got applied. I can actually disable it by going to we actually have this, right? So we have hype and create, but this is its own ligature. If I make it like this, this goes away, right? But that might be not what we want. Okay, let's see. At this point, I just start to feel that we are making too many exceptions, right? But at least those test cases seems to work. So let's. Let's insert them here. Let's comment them. Yeah, and now we need to exit here. We need to export font. Go back. Yeah, these cases work. This is reassuring actually i'm going to disable this to just see the beautiful shapes <laughs> not the gap not the not don't see the gaps actually no i actually may want to see gaps because uh, i know because i like to punish myself because this is the worst this can look right and i would like to imagine how it looks at its worst, worst. Okay. Um, double. So what we need now is double arrows. These things. Okay, but let me think first. So can we actually? We can, right? So we can actually have this work by. Yeah. Let's. We have building blocks. <laughs> let's go here again. Uh, let's find this hyphen greater here. Let's unmark it as no export. Let's close this. Let's regen ligatures. Um, let's reopen. Right. And now we have uh, this problem, but it's fine, right? As as well along these lines because we removed it, we can actually remove this as well because it doesn't exist. Okay, but now uh, now uh, so you see we can just make if it's we see hyphen 
if we see hype and follow it by radar, right? We replace it with hype and start. Uh, yeah, that's actually should be enough. Just insert this line. Okay, let's see. Let's see if it actually works. So we don't introduce one special case, and this is good. So we, we built uh, the same arrow, the short arrow from the same building blocks we built everything else from. And this is nice, and I like how the simplicity of this. Okay. Um, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, good, great. So we have like left part of the left part of of the bar we have uh, like right part of the bar which is actually like the slight offset right we have right part of the arrow we have left part part of the arrow <laughs> we can see it like this but we, we do um it, it even interfaces nicely with those as long as we disable i don't know what what do we disable here um i think i'm not sure if ignore let you put multiple let's find let's find out right so hyphen, hyphen. Oh, hyphen, 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 hyphen. yeah okay so for example here right so we what we do want is to write something like this I think it should be allowed, but sometimes what you think is allowed not all, is, not, is not always possible. Yeah, it works. Cool. So uh, yeah, that makes life slightly easier for us. We just disallow those on the left and we this allows us on the right and be with it, right? So in same applies here. So bracket left is because we don't want, oops. No, no, this is okay. We don't this want this to work inside um, progress bars, like, like those, right? So that's why we disable it. But actually, yeah, kind of. Uh, but we will have infinitely infinite arrows inside anyways, right? So let's see. Um, say we have something like this. Okay, what I actually want. try yeah and no 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 we exit we save and we exit we join actually if i wrote this script not in closure but in python and made it plugin for glyphs i might have avoided this reload thing but I don't want to really. Okay, okay. Actually, yeah, no, no it doesn't matter. Um, this is a new font. We click export. We go to Sublime. We exit Sublime. Because sometimes more complicated things work inside glyphs, but don't work in real uh, editors like Sublime or VS Code. Or, yeah, yeah, we, we still get our progress bars actually nicer than so for example inside progress bar you will have two dashes, not as two dashes like this, but you'll have them as straight line. Which is great, which is great. Yeah, I think this is we are we are good here. Um we need to have double arrows as well, and we have we need to have like reverse arrows. I think we start with reverse. Maybe actually, maybe, 
maybe I should start naming them like left uh, this is obviously right right or end yeah let's start naming them start and this is end and this is start okay and we need to change this um, accordingly start to start to start cont is end later r is end and this r is start okay yeah so we go here yeah um bum, 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 bum. cut 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 let's call this compile greater r still oh, ah yeah, yeah, yeah so we still need to regen because because <laughs> because there are other features that include uh, all glyphs in file that's, that's why when renaming you have to regen you have to regen those as well yeah but uh right now this should compile actually let's see compiles and here we should see everything is working as expected right Okay, let's start by doing, let's go to arrows, let's go to arrows, yeah, here. So we need now, we need greater start and less end, okay, so let's greater start and uh, I will go and open it. so this is greater start right so what we need to do is it means that it was greater height than this one we move it by glyph width actually we need to check that this is consistent okay and we need to cut it the same way this one is so okay <laughs> um 259 and 217 if i remember correctly okay so yeah, 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 yeah. this has to go this which is fine <laughs> yeah and here i think i think it should be 217 if i remember correctly oops yeah uh, okay so let's see then 983 like like three yeah but now this is too big so we will decompose we we actually need to introduce a few points here and there let's make it here and here maybe do this and we okay and this too much we need to compose this as well introduce two points we don't need it here but we need the um, we need points to match between bold and non-bold versions so that they translate interpolate correctly i think this is all fine yeah, yeah. okay 
so this is our greater start and now we have less end less and means hyper less right this one stays in place we decompose we move it to 59 um go to the bolt here is the same decompose here it must be two three eighteen okay let's just Oh no 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 no! Actually, here it has to be minus two twenty seven. Oh, this is change number. Yeah, it, this is this is correct. It's actually two seventeen plus ten. <laughs> um, minus two. Actually, uh, I think like this yeah and here we have to be minus two plus ten yeah two sixty nine correct yes great so this this two already making nice ligature which is fine by me but this one could not really exist uh, it would have to be yeah i think something else Cool, 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 cool. And we have them. Uh, we have to make this bolder. Forgot about it. Five, six, six, okay. Six. Yes, yes. Cool. And here we do the same. Okay, and actually, if this would work better, yeah, we can do this. Um, super, super. So now what we need to do, right? So what we need to do, I don't know what we need to do. Um, we need to do <laughs> the same, but with other directions. So in our case, if we see so we see less hyphen like this we see greater hyphen we replace it with great start right okay we see greater start arrow so any starts or hyphen end we continue with the hyphen maybe move it here Maybe I leave the comments, right? So continue hyphen uh, beginnings. This is not beginning, right? So I just end. So this is ends and these are beginnings. this uh, here we do something else but it's fine and ends if you have hyphen start hyphen end or we have less we have less end right Let's see. Let's see if it works. Let's see. It, it should work. Um, what we should be able to see is no, no, actually this, 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 uh, this, this, this. So it starts <laughs> starting to be. 
slightly slow-ish, so maybe I should invent a new file for it. Not like this, like this. Okay, and yeah, I need to cut here, of course. Okay, so now it doesn't work at all. Let me okay, this we don't need. Nothing works, but yeah. Okay, so we go here, we find our beautiful substitution. This one, we replace it in its entirety. We compile, it compiles, it's, it's a good sign. Okay, so nothing works because the ignores are not updated, right? Because I change it ignores here, here, bracket left, less greater uh, for hyphen, 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 but they were not updated. So let's save, let's close, let's update glyphs. Okay. What do we do next? We open. It still doesn't work. What the fuck? So now I'm confused. This all works. This doesn't, right? So it, it kind of works, right? So it works correctly for this. So what, what um, makes me really happy is that now I, I, I don't have to build like combinatory explosion of different beginnings and ends. And instead, I can just uh, do it once. Anyway, um, yes, something is not right. So something is fisher here. So bracket left less greater. Um, hmm. Hyphen, hyphen. So maybe the syntax doesn't work. Let's go and check, right? So maybe the syntax doesn't work. Maybe I was too um, actually not even here. Why it's not here? Huh. Okay, now it's really strange. So this this should be in file, right? We have another hyphen hyphen sir. No. So what seems to be the problem? Okay, okay, let's. Uh, this is this is bad, but uh, let me redo this all. Okay, this is our test case. We're also going to save it in here because this is important that everything works. All right, so this one is already covered, this one is covered, this one and even this one. Oh, okay, let's let's leave it here. So okay, now let's close this file. Okay, so we don't have fear. Okay, we don't need this, obviously. Let's update. Yeah? 
Let's go to glyph back to glyphs. Let's reopen. Yeah. Let's go to find hyphen hyphen. Hyphen. It's not here. What the fuck? Something. Um, did I mess up something so it star stopped to update the cult call? Ah, <gasps> yeah, no. Oh, I couldn't be. I put some comments inside, but this should be shouldn't be a problem, right? I can't even find. It. Okay, so let's let's leave it like that. So for some reason the code stopped to update. Um, let's reopen. Okay, now it's everything is fine. Yes, yeah, so it, it didn't update the code for some reason. Um, I'm not sure. Yeah, it shouldn't contain comments in between. Maybe, no, I couldn't. Actually, this is strange. This should be fine, right? Okay, there is faster way, so we can just uh, cut. Okay, now it's somewhere. So now it works, it seems. Okay. Let's reopen. So now this work. This kind of work. This one doesn't work, right? So. And this one. So something about this two is not. Okay, so we know that this ligature, that, uh, anyway, the ligature uh, in question is this, this hyphen greater, yeah, because this should be hyphen hyphen. It actually should be like this. Let's update. Hmm. So either it didn't update or Update again. So okay, but it's it's not okay. But for some reason, it stopped updating. Right? So hmm. it stopped updating. Let's see.
I mean, it used to work. I'm not sure what happened. String replace. Okay, let's. Print. Um, This um, so cult is not in font. Features index code, and here we what we want to do is print when no more re matches. This is our re. Okay, and we go here, we turn off saving, don't care about saving, let's see. Yeah, so it doesn't match here. Okay, so this is interesting. This is interesting. Um, I wonder what happened. I wonder what happened. It might be that there is some. Actually, <laughs> I'm now thinking that there is some internal limit for how far ahead uh, lookup is. Right. So let's let's find. So, for example, there's start or generated code, and let's say we delete like half of it. Okay, save. No, it's still not much. Still not much. Okay. Um, might be we are looking at the wrong thing actually. Let's see. No, it's called to right. Um, hmm. What about this. Okay. No, it doesn't work. Oh, that's interesting. Actually, we should be using this. We don't want like the whole. Okay, let's see. Now it doesn't work. Um, if we put
Uh -huh. Now it kind of works, but let's say we actually replace make and then we replace again. Now it works. How is it? Uh, because uh, like what was that? Mm, I'm not sure even. Oops. Yeah, I'm not sure we even updating. Um, Yeah, like this. Okay, so what if I go and change this? For example, back to this, right? Close this, regen, kind of work ish. Yes, it works. Um, let me see if I can replace this with just dot plus. So that plus doesn't work anymore. Okay, perfect. But not hash plus works. I I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But did I fix it? Okay, it works for now. So this looks good. This looks good. I think we are good, right? So we undid most of the stuff that had to be undone. I hope this still works. Yeah, this still works. Um, I mean. I don't think I need something, anything special here. Like, but anyway, yeah. Uh, let's see the ligatures that we disabled. So, ah, uh, doubles. Uh, the doubles. Okay. We also need doubles, right? Mm, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's let's do intermediate step and export everything in here and see that this looks as beautiful as we needed to. Um, working sublime. Yes, perfect. So now everything looks perfect except for this. So here we need kind of do the same trick, but uh, we are going to have, we'll, we'll have Uh, whatever. <laughs> uh, whatever. Yeah, we will need. What we will need? Two beginnings and two ends, and that's it. I think. Right. I, I should have some tables here. So yeah, 
lines already look beautiful. I can do it with vertical lines, but horizontal lines look beautiful now. And this is reassuring. I, I think actually maybe I have to stage it for now at least. Oops. On stage, I need this honey, but I don't need this. So that we will have some state to go back to if we need to. Okay. Okay. So now go to arrows. Uh, this should be blue as well. What we need now is. Less, less start arrow, less, less end arrow, greater, greater start arrow, and greater, greater end arrow. Okay, so make some blue. So we can find it here. Um, let's actually open everything. Right? Oops. T is not needed. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we have. Uh, other thing we need to make sure is so these are beginnings that take uh, like two spaces so this is and we actually we need one ending and one beginning this we don't need okay uh, so if we have this is a start right so what we need is an end here with a space then we have start space and another end okay then we have space here uh, actually no it, it's gonna be it's going to work like this There's space, there is this, and there is end. So these are endings, right? And these are beginnings. Okay, let's start. So greater, greater, end. Yeah, let's start. What, what's here? Let's do. So what we need is is hyper greater greater. This one. V D compose and remove it. Up till here, right? Well, actually, yeah, it's, it's, it was simple. Um, hmm. Yes, we and the same. No, not this one. We and this one. We decompose. Remove it. I'm not sure if it sticks or not. Doesn't seem to stick, right? Yeah. Some extra. Yeah, this was easy. Huh. Huh. This was easy. Okay, let's see if this one is going to be easy. So here we need hyper less less. Yeah, this one is going to be easy as well. Oops. Let's forget this. Uh, compose right here. Uh, for some reason, oops. No, 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 no. This one. Yeah. For some reason, we probably need one, two, three, four, five, six. Digest this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, but this is a good thing. And we'll fill here. Decompose. Move it. Yeah. Okay. So 
so we will be able to draw arrows like this which is exciting exciting yeah okay here uh, uh, we are going to need greater greater hyphen like this it is gonna be set to here decomposed decomposed just a reminder that this is a beginning yes no no we are doing it wrong actually we are, we are adding space we should be adding this one yes uh, the ligature was correct we need, but we need to move it slightly differently Pause. You can pause again. Move this one here. Now I don't do overlaps. Oh no, I do overlaps. So this one is overlapping actually, but it has to be overlapped. You can pause. You can pause. Okay. And Three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so right. Yeah, it's in right. Cool. Okay, so this one is easy as well. And here we are going to need less, less hyphen. This and you can pause and you can pause again. Move this one here. Okay. Oops, 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 oops. No, 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 no. Ah, shit. Let's grab a space. Let's let's let that one. Okay, these are types of arrows that we're supposed to have now. Um, huh. Yeah, I probably sh should start. So it's gonna be like this. Right. Also, like obviously, double do like this one. I'm just uh, trying to invent every possible combination because there are actually a few things to you can miss doing those and I don't really want to miss them right? Be because like this is a program and it executes somehow and uh, it re replaces all the things and result of one replacement can be an input for another replacement and everything like uh, depends on everything and can change everything can undo anything so yeah so that's why i'm actually trying just to be safe i wanted to 
yeah so if we enable alternates we get oh yeah the problem actually is is that double um double less and double greater are ligatures on their own it's not actually a problem it's fine actually it makes our life easier right so we rely on them to already be substituted so what we are looking for is we want to substitute um for example less less liga followed by hyphen we want to substitute that uh, yes, we definitely want to substitute it by less less star oops, start L. Then if it's greater greater linger hyphen not the hyphen so we greater greater. All right, so we substitute those. Um, we have two more starts. So let's go to start, let's start, try to start. So we have less start, less, less start. Oops. Less, less start. Greater start. <laughs> greater, greater start. Uh, hyphen start, hyphen out. Okay. Uh, and endings, right? So endings are easier ish. If we have, but we have to be. Yeah, yeah. So now this one is going to conflict a little bit with what we did. Maybe not. Maybe not. But I'm not sure. Less. So let's say this substitution happens. Then we will have. Yeah, this is actually simpler. Let's say we have less end arrow, and then we have another less, right? That means that the first one is going to be substituted by less spacer and uh, no, 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 this is not mm, it's not good. Okay, another thing. Can, for example, this no, it cannot. Right. Um, yes, yeah, so the problem here is actually, it's maybe it's not a problem. So, if we have this combination, we replace less by less less and arrow but then we have this here I have to replace this by less spacer I'm not sure this is gonna work but I'm gonna try I'm going to try This is our code. See if it compiles. It compiles. So if it compiles, that means something. Mm -hmm. So none of the endings actually work. Which one we tried less? So this one should have worked. We didn't, right? Um, 
maybe that's because let me find the bigger choice in here. Uh, this is not what we're interested in. We also have triple ones. Wow. Mm. Yeah, we, uh, we have to go in here. Less, less. Yeah, we have less, less. Cool. Um, But what we are actually interested in is prefixes, not suffixes, right? So if there is hyphen less less, we don't want to replace it. Um, same goes for greater. Actually, yeah, we put hyphen in, the, in, in here too. Uh -huh. So asterisk plus dollar and hyphen. We don't want that. And we don't want that. Okay, triple ones we don't touch. Triple ones are okay. And just for oops. Oops. Um, this one is just for simplicity. Okay. Okay. So let's see. We do this. We save. We close. Hopefully, our code updates. Have to investigate what the fuck was that? Why I didn't update? But not on stream. Okay, let's see. Magic moment. <laughs> yeah, so it didn't really work, right? So let's find it. So there is another way for us. Oh no, I wasted. Okay, so. one way is just to change the order let's see if it works not really no um, so if we have less okay let me see um, let, me, let me open the file this one Okay, so the, the trick is like this. If we see less, followed by another less, right? Actually, if we see even hyphen less, less, like this, right? We replace first less by less spacer. And then, if you see less spacer, oops, and then another less, just like this, right? So we replace the second one by less, less, and arrow. So this is what we should be aiming for in here. Okay, compile. And nothing works. No, no, something works. No, it works. Yeah, here it works. Uh, cool, but this don't work, uh, it's, which is unfortunate. But we'll deal with it in a moment. Um, 
Uh, now we just replace everything with greater here. Uh, we add this gray. Oops. Ah, uh, shit. Here we compile release the dash here. Now nothing works. Cool. Why doesn't anything works now? Oh no, it it works. Ish. So endings work, right? Kind of. And it's work. Yeah, yeah, so beginnings don't work. Okay, so here everything is all right. Here everything is all right. This is good news, actually. Uh, beginnings don't work. Beginnings don't work. Why? I think, I think. Um, I don't see where, wait, what? So we actually hope, oh no, because we, we're relying to this ligature and we actually disable this ligature. Yeah. Um, okay, we will just have to re-implement it, right? So, so this is what's going on, less, less hyper, right? We replace first less by less spacer. Uh, we replace spacer less uh, with less less start arrow like this. And we do the same for greater. This one's we remove. If I put it here, I'm not sure in which order this execute. Still, I have to. So I did so much, and I'm still not sure um, how exactly those rules are applied. Yeah, um, no, this is wrong. This is wrong. Why is it wrong? Okay, let's try moving those higher. I don't know. Yeah, and it works. Uh, does it work here? I don't know. So I guess the uh, ones on, on the top takes precedence. Um, this is actually okay. Okay, so let me just copy this. Paste it here. And break it down a little bit more. So so double ends, single ends, double beginnings, single beginnings. Okay. Um, I wonder if I should order it like this and. File. No, now I broke something. Oh my god. So you cannot really reorder things. I'm not sure why. I, <laughs> I wish I knew, but for some reason it doesn't work like that. 
This is one of the last biggest puzzles in this whole deal. Okay, here. Seems to work, seems to work. So, is it it? Is it really it? So I now can do like stuff like this. Wow. And it can be of any length. This is amazing. Really. Okay, yeah, uh, let's uh, save, export, next, quit this. And you open Sublime. Yeah, I think I would like uh, to add some few combinations like this one, this one, and this one. <laughs> no, uh, like all all. Combinations are important, interesting, and stuff like that. So I think, yeah, these ones are done. These ones, yeah, this one I, I'm not touching today. But we did it. We actually did it. Yeah, look at it. Um, yeah, another one. If we go here, I have to rename them. Old RAM because I'm removed now. I wonder if I can just create smart filter with Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, but uh, the thing is, the removed is slightly different, so I change the name. So later, I keep the glyph itself, but if I need the shapes, right? But it doesn't take up the name. So if I want to, to create a new one in its place, I can do that. And it's also not displayed in Liga section. Also, this one would be probably easier to fix uh, another thing to do would be to do the same but with equals instead of hyphen so that um, you know uh, <laughs> it's the same work but like different <gasps> yeah I actually need to check if uh, bar ligatures are okay it's like curls like this I, I hope they are okay they should be okay right yeah okay they are okay so the problem with them is so I, I want to draw this but I also want to draw this maybe it's not a problem actually maybe I should yeah maybe I should make this like beginning and end as well but then there are those oh my god <laughs> so there's there is a lot of work okay but but maybe maybe i will do it i don't know for now let's finish up with what we have right we have uh well actually what we need to do is just Check carefully that everything hyphen hyphen greater, hyphen ram, hyphen greater, hyphen greater, greater. Well, if this is hyphen hyphen greater, hyphen greater, hyphen greater. less. Um, yes, it's okay ish. Mark them actually with blue because 
blue is everything I touched in this version and it just helps you navigate it's nothing more okay okay so ligatures mine new mm -hmm. hyphen start hyphen end right uh, yeah arrows removed ligatures seems okay so let's proceed and go actually change log let's make a commit because i don't consider work done until i commit it arrows hyphen arrows yeah there are more uh three four six three four six oh actually yeah Let's go and commit it. Okay. I'm not closing the task because I plan to do more, but yeah. Stage, stage. Stage hunk. Don't stage this for now, right? So this is just debug print. Um, and commit. And push. Okay, I think that we are at two hour mark. This is it's pretty good, right? So yeah, it's, it's pretty long and boring, I guess, not good. But anyway, uh, this is how much time it takes to develop some new feature. I think it's an amazing feature, actually. So I'm really glad that we figured out how to do that. I am really grateful for the person who brought it in with the idea how to implement it. Um, I am not sure, but wow. So this is a feature request from 2017. I was sure it was pretty fresh, but it isn't right. So, so he suggested to use reverse substitutions, which are also a thing, but we don't have, I, I, I cannot make them work in glyphs for some reason but we managed without them right so we just go from left to right and we start replacing hyphens and uh yeah and at the end we just decide which ending we want to draw so yeah it actually worked fine for us so yeah i think i hope it was pretty interesting it was for me and uh this is this is great feature that that alone i think it make a good a new version for Fira code. I'm planning to do monthly versions for now and yeah so they will be smaller than usual before that I was doing like one version per three months or four months uh, now it is every month I spend the whole day working on Fira code alone and whatever I get done I just release it so that's stable stream of updates and you, I, I'm, I, I don't want to wait until I have enough features done whatever I get done at that time it's uh, got published so this is going to be in version 4 um, I hope it was interesting and thank you for watching uh, use your code bye bye